folks well welcome back we got fuel we got my cup of coffee here uh at one bravo one big county uh 483 a gallon it's still the cheapest in the area um so we are going to head back to orange county let's taxi on over to two two um that weather um cleared on the other side of the airport, uh, the 2-2, or the 0-3 approach, um, was socked in down there. So I had to go around, but over, and the left down went for a 2-1. That was interesting. But you know, there's still, there's still some uh, down there. But so instead of taking off a uh, 2-1 uh, and going right into it, uh, I could probably get around it, but we'll play it safe. We'll use three. So let's put three there. Uh, we'll use three and make a left um, crosswind and uh, so on and so forth. Winds are calm still. Let's check it out. Columbia County Airport. Automated weather observation. One, three, three, two. Zulu, weather, wind, calm, visibility, one, zero, clear, below, one, two, thousand, temperature, one, eight, Celsius, dew point, one, five, altimeter, three, zero, one, eight. All right, three, zero, one, eight, calm, winds are calm, we'll use three, uh, one, change this barometer, um, boom, boom. We're all good there. Everything's looking good. Planes flying awesome. Everything looks good. Uh, next year, yeah, Mooney will go to Oshkosh next year. Uh, that is for sure undecided if it will be on display uh, by the uh, Dynon uh, booth or not. We'll see. It's taxi. We'll probably use Albany Approach. We'll go back. We'll use Flight Following again. There's some low clouds. I could have went took it off 2-1, or uh, 3. Uh, I'm sorry, 2-1. Um, very thin. You can see the other side of the, uh, of the fog there, but it's all right. Still taxiing. A lot of ducks off that left camera if you can see them or not, but they're laying down there. Uh, the geese. I, they're the geese. I hit a goose. There's a little, all of them. I hit a goose a couple years back coming in that night. Just hit the last one in the flock on short approach. Or short final, I should say. Uh, on, what was wrong way was that? 2-2 two, two, at Orange County. So that kind of little, a little, little ding size of a, a nickel maybe in the leading edge. But it didn't rip out the uh, pedo tube, at least. There's crap. There's crap everywhere. <laughs> okay, run up time. We're gonna check everything out, make sure we're good. And um, I always like to, even though I landed for about 10, 15 minutes, I like to continue to check checklists because one of the magnetos could have went bad in the meantime, um, or a fuel pump, belt driven fuel pump could have went. So let's do this. I'll go back to 1900 RPMs, brakes are set. Get close as we can here. 19. Hmm. Alright, we're pretty much close enough there. Uh, so we're going to check the mags again. Let's go to the right mag. Okay, we got a drop, a roughness, and then we have the exhaust temperatures going up. That's good, back to both. The exhaust temperature is going down, no roughness. We're back up to our 1800 and change. The left mag, a drop, and no roughness, and we have the exhaust temperatures going up. So back to both. They're running perfectly fine. And then we'll just check to, we'll do a cycle. Okay, oil pressure down. RPMs down. And nothing on the windshield. We have no seals leaking. 
and we'll put that full forward. Um, and we're going to check out the, the uh, carb heat here. Whoop, put it all the way out. Okay, nice drop. Perfect, that's working. And oil pressure is good, oil temperature is good, fuel flow is good, looking all good. Fuel pressure, I'm sorry, is good. Um, and we have the fuel flow, everything else in the green, so we're looking pretty good. Voltage is good, amps are good. So I'll pull back to 1000. And we'll pull the mixture out, because we're not quite ready yet. Um, friction lock is snug. I'm going to do flaps 15, take off flaps, and we'll trim up just a smidgen. When you put the uh, flaps up, it's going to pitch up, so I don't put too much of trim. Um, and we're looking good. Carpe is off. Uh, pitot tube we don't need. Pump is off still. We'll put it on shortly. I like to save the fuel pump instead of sitting here with the fuel pump on for five extra five minutes. And doors. We'll lock the doors. Doors are locked and secure. Locked and secure. And then land light is on, strobes are on, anti-collision light is on, radios are obviously on. We're good to go and take note, brake release, we're not going to do that quite yet. What we're going to do, so checklist is complete. Um, I did walk around again. I always walk around just in case I hit something didn't know it. Everything was free and correct. So we're all good there. Everything is working correctly there. Put that down here. So we're going to go to, we're going to go to, direct to Orange County. Uh, KMGJ, enter, enter. It's fine right there. We have Albany approach in the standby when we came in. We'll, we'll see if we can get them going back. We'll go up to 45. We'll go up to 45 and the way back because it is evens plus fives. Um, I think sometimes uh, 25 is too low. Uh, too low at 25. Um, let's see. We're good there. And then our course heading is going to be 222 like it always is. On the winds, it could change, but 222 two, two for now. So we have uh, 222 two, two in the heading. We have 4,500 bugged uh, for the altitude. We have a barometer set, and we're all set. And here's 52.4 nautical miles away, just barely across country, but it is. Go to maps. We're looking good. Alrighty. Let's see if anything's going on here. Hey, Columbia County traffic. Anybody short base a final for three? Columbia County traffic. Mooney, 8, 7 November, taking runway 3 for departure. Columbia County traffic. Okay, I like this on full maps, just so I have it for traffic. We're on full maps here. Mixture now comes full forward. Remember to put the mixture in full forward, and remember to put the... Uh, up full forward for maximum RPMs, and then fuel pump is now coming on, lane light is on, strobes are on, anti-collision light is on. So we're all set. Everything's locked. Everything's clear to Johnson Bar here. I want to smash your phone up or not get the gear up. We're gonna watch. Get, we're gonna get those geese are sleeping or laying down. So we got to just pretty big birds, and if I hit one of those or the prop hits it, it might be a teardown. So we got to be careful. A lot of bird doo doo on the approach end here, lots of it. Uh, runway three, okay. We're lined up, we are all set, everything's in the green still, and we're gonna look for fuel flow, and then back over to 60 knots we need, so full power. Full power is in. A lot of right rudder here. Passing the birds. Good fuel flow, 15 and a half, looking for 60, 60 knots, 60, rotate. Perfect rotation. Now the gear can come up. And we'll trip down a little bit. It's a cool this morning. Yeah, still some clouds that way, but we'll be above them. Some fog. All right, looking good. Looking awesome, actually. And with those flaps up, trim down. Columbia County traffic. Mooney turning left base. Correction, left crosswind. Three or ten. Columbia County. Jeez, I'm all mixed up today. There's some low. You look out this camera here. There is some low fog. The valley here. We're going to be above that in about a few minutes. 
Columbia County traffic, we need to turn it downwind on way three. Columbia County traffic. Okay. Get the power pulled back. A good thousand feet over here. And power coming back, power coming back, power coming back, power coming back. I like 25, 25, but it climbs to 45. Columbia County traffic, Mooney 8, 7 November, departure pattern to the southwest, climb up to 1,500. See ya. All right, let's go over to Albany. I see no traffic in the area, so we're good to clear this radio station. Radio frequency, we're looking good. Uh, let's go over to Albany. Let's see if we can get a, a flight following. Hey, gear up, flaps up, fuel pump coming off, laying light coming off. Trip down a little bit. Okay, everything sounds pretty quiet over there. Albany, good morning. Mooney, 6887 November request. Albany, 6887 November, Albany approach. Good morning, sir. Just departed Columbia County, 1 Bravo 1, climbing through 1,900 for 4,500. Request flight following, sir, to Orange County Airport, Mike Golf, Juliet. Mooney, 87 to hours, squawk 7373. 7373 in a box now, 487 November. Okay, that's that. Mooney, 87 to hours, radar contact, 4 miles southwest of the Columbia County Airport, Albany, out to 3017, say out to. 3017, sir, and we are climbing through 2,400. Okay, pretty easy. Lights, uh, winds are very, very light um, out of the north, um, and we're going to just uh, keep climbing. 500 feet per minute sounds pretty much cool, and they'll go to 4,500. By the time we get up there, we'll be ready to go. Um, how's that weather doing? Yeah, it's out towards the east. That's the weather that messed me up today to go out and chill on the islands today, but that's okay. And we have already Orange County AWOS. I will just swap that over. Albany approach, exit jet 409, uh, with you 11000, and, and we have the automated weather at Saratoga. 409, Albany approach, Albany altimeter 3017, and when able, say approach request. We like the visual, runway 23. Exit 409, Roger, clear direct Saratoga. Direct to uh, Saratoga, exit jet. Board your nine. All big horses here is one nine seven zero one thousand three hundred climbing four thousand. Okay, so we are all in the green, we are we're looking good, we are quite following with Albany, and we're headed to Orange County, New York. Everything's, uh, besides a little patch over here behind us, uh, there's no fog. There's no fog in the valleys anymore. It kind of burnt off some little patches here and there, but that's not a big deal. Um, and we're going to cruise it on here. Cruise on up. 109, uh, distant and maintain 10,000. 10,000, exit 10409. Six hundred feet per minute. We're climbing through three thousand five hundred. I got a little bit of right runner in. Come on, there you go. A P factor. A P factor. The prop turns right really fast, and it torques the plane to turn. And more power you have, the more you got to use right rudder. Once you get up in altitude, it is pretty much oh P factor. Okay. Fuel pumps off, lang light is off, gear up indicated on the panel here, and gear up indicated on the uh, Dynon screen, which is right here, and gear down, which is really cool that uh, they tied that in with my <laughs> manual gear. Manual Johnson bar gear. 
it's hard to beat that gear, folks. All the electric stuff is cool. I get it. But... With the Johnson bar, the gear is up or the gear is down. The only thing you got to make sure that that gear is locked into this uh, locking device, I guess you would call it. We're getting up there. we start leveling off here. I'll I'll get a um, a warning shortly. We're approaching our altitude. Approaching altitude. There you go, 200 feet warning. And we're going to start trimming down a little bit here. Because it uh, take a couple hundred feet to get it level. Or not. Okay, so our power is pulled back. I don't want to go too fast. And let's... Out a little bit. All right, we're four thousand five hundred, and we're just approaching the Hudson River. We're all in the green here. A little more fuel. Winds out of 100 degrees at 07 knots, and a crosswind is pretty much exactly 06, 07 knots. So, uh, while well, we have about a 217 indicated on the heading, but our course heading is 220, it's compensating for that crosswind. You're basically flying like this. If you fly like this, straight, without crabbing, uh, the wind's going to push you whoop, over here. But to compensate for the crosswind, the plane's nose is here, but the body is here, and it, that's how you get on course and stay on course, because it can throw you way off course um, if the plane didn't crab. That's why you have the, th the uh, three axes. Need the rudder, need the aileron, and need back pressure. Back pressure you need, because even though you're straight and level, the plane's still pitched up, because that's how you fly. The plane's always be pitched up, and that's how you fly. So you need all the components in the plane to work, so you can fly. We're looking good, my folks. We're looking good here. I want to take the time real quick to really thank all the followers on my Facebook page. Uh, it's approaching 36,000. Um, 7 November contact, uh, New York approach, 132.75. 32.75 now for 8, 7 November. Good day, sir. Thank you. Uh, radar contact, about 10 to the south of Houston at 4,600. Stuart Altimer, 3016. Contact with traffic uh, 3016, uh, 2461 Papa. And 61 Papa, what was your destination? Sky Manor, November 40. Sky Manor. Good York, good morning. Mooney 87 November is with you, 4500. 687 November, New York approach. Roger, the uh, Stuart Ultimate 3016. 16 for 87 November, thank you. Okay, one, six. Contact, New York Approach, one, two, three. Um, so, but yeah, but thank you so much for the support on Facebook. Uh, and uh, on TikTok now on Instagram. So Facebook is really, really climbing. Uh, thank you. And if you like what I'm doing on this channel here, folks, subscribe to the channel. Really appreciate that as well. It's not, too, it's not an exciting channel, uh, but I like to show everybody... Um, how flying is not that difficult, um, and you know, keep pushing for yourself to get it done. You know, everybody has their issues. Um, I have had a ton of issues, and uh, I push hard to get my dream, which was aviation. And here I am, uh, years later, uh, flying a Mooney and having fun. It's not easy. It takes uh, sometimes a handful of jobs, 
Um, uh, and, but if you're passionate about things, whether it's aviation, cars, whatever it might be, if you're passionate about, you might have to have two or three jobs to support uh, that hobby uh, until you move up in life. Um, that's what I did. And um, I, if it wasn't for my grandmother, uh, God rest her soul, uh, I would not be doing this. So she pushed me a lot to do it. So here I am, flying over the Hudson River, flying in the northeast, flying in the Hudson Valley, beautiful views, uh, worked hard, and here we are. And it, it, it's, you, you have to work hard for your dreams. I've been saying this to a lot of people. You just got to do it, and you got to work. And you got to, even though you might get five hours of sleep, I mean, I used to sleep on my overnight shift as, as a security guard at a mall. I hope it doesn't get back to him, but that was like 15 years ago, or 20 years ago. Um, because I worked at college, I had to pay, and, you know, uh, dad passed away, young age, and all this stuff. So, just got to keep going, folks. Keep going, pushing. And this is what you like to do. You could do it. You really could do it. And, uh, you know, me in middle school and high school, I was always told you can't do it. And, you know, but uh, here I am, and I'm very proud and happy to be here. And all my hard work and dedication uh, paid off. We're not just aviation, but also as a volunteer EMT, uh, you know, helping run that that organization and moving forward. So I'm proud of what I've done and uh, what I accomplished. And you guys can do the same thing. Don't let anybody tell you you can't do it. Let them tell you that, but prove them wrong. So I don't think anybody's jumping in Gardner. Um, ATC would have gave us a heads up. Uh, Gardner has a lot of jumpers. It's a private little airport. Um, they have New York approach, uh, extra. They have jumpers. But I don't see. Um, Again. Cole Belt. New York uh, Extra 3 Niners 3. I don't see Real them field. jumping on the screen of ATC. They didn't tell me yet. Uh, what we're going to do is uh, put the fuel pump on. I'm going to switch tanks. Uh, just so I can burn off this tank because I filled them both up really high. Zero. All the way up as so I could. Right now you said. Um, as you guys saw. But I'm going to switch tanks right now. If I get this belt. Zero. Say again, sir, for the squawk. Clock zero three one two and I dent. Okay. Zero three one two. Switched over. Put this back on. Let's slow down. I'm trying to take a slow flight here, but we're at forty indicated. One tw uh, twenty two inches over twenty four and a half. Okay, fuel pumps coming off. Keep this on a lot. Uh, first of all, I like just keeping it on. Uh, you don't. Know, you never know when t some turbulence might hit you. But also by the ridges here, you get bumps. That one's like hit, hit my head. So we are 24 nautical miles out. Block 4252, I'm going to go down to 3500. Almost here already. So maybe we'll do a two runway or just listen to their weather real quick. Julie Tier, just had a maintain pull. Automated weather observation. 1355 Zulu. Wind 020 at 03. Visibility 10. 10. 10. 10. 10. Sky condition clear. Temperature 18 Celsius. Dew point 16 Celsius. Altimeter 3015. Remarks. Density altitude 600. Orange County Airport. They're probably using four. So let's go to frequency. Let's go to Orange County Uticom, and we'll put that in the standby. And we're going to cancel. Uh, we're going to cancel ATC shortly. I have the airport actually in sight. You can see Orange County Airport miles away because it's just so big. But we need to get down to 3,500. 4116 uh, kilo. Your radar contact about seven to the southwest of Kingston Old Sir at 3,000. The uh, Stuart altimeter is 3016. 3016 for 16 kilo. 16 kilo, I'd like to do the RNAV 26 to Bunnery into Stuart, I mean into uh, Orange County full stop. Okay, you're looking for an IFR clearance into Orange? That is correct, that's what I used to like. 4116 kilo, uh, you're cleared to Orange County via uh, Hunat Direct, climb maintain 4000. I maintain 4,000 direct, 16 kilo. 
Yeah, New York Mooney, Ace Member can cancel with you, sir. Orange County is in sight. 7 November, Roger Ray, sir. Terrain, squawk to order, food change is approved. Good day. Good day, squawk, food change approved. Good day, thanks for the help. Okay, we're good there. We'll switch over to that. That's, that's how easy, folks, is play following. And the more you do it in practice, you mess up like I did in the way to Columbia County. He gave me a different squawk, but I thought a, a, a radio. I had to go check back my playback, and he did mention the squawk. That's why I... Uh, County traffic, I, on a three-mile short final for 04. Uh, and that's why Four I called him back to confirm again. Three, three, yes, that was a frequent squawk across, change. Uh, it's, 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 four, it's, it's, they're not going to bite your head off. Let's just face it. Okay, we're 18 miles out, we got the weather, we're using four, I heard you're using four, um, and we're, we're clear, we got traffic though, okay, we have one, two, three, four, it's like in the pattern, uh, yeah, one, two, three, four. I'm just got traffic, Piper's on a two mile final, oh four, looking for the traffic. Okay, nice traffic descent here. All well, the traffic. Orange County is like, poof. On a, on a weekend? Yeah, we got, we got pay flight aviation out of Orange County. Uh, it's one of the best flight schools in the country. Uh, they have, I, I don't really know, I'll be lying to you if I guess, but I would say 20 plus airplanes and they're all diamonds and they have a couple twins. They have all this fun stuff over there. And it's a busy flight school. God bless them, you know? But um, a lot of planes. So one thing I got to worry about is, and I'm very pro pl flight schools and everything else. They got to teach people. It is what it is. You know, we all got to get along. But uh, uh, they can't get very congested. Um, and all you do is you basically just tell them if you can sneak in, they take off. If they're having, you know, three, four planes in a pattern, it's almost hard to get out because you have have every plane uh, sequence so perfectly that you almost can't get out when they're short base to final or base uh, the, the trap pattern in Orange County. So, there's a quite a few out here, and yeah, we're going to pay attention to them. Well, no straight in, obviously, and um, we're going to go, we're, we're on the, the basically almost a 2-2 two -two heading, but we're going to go um, right, of, right of course, a 2-2 two -two course, and then uh, connect it downwind uh, for four, and we'll listen to traffic and see what's going on. Pretty straightforward. Nice descent. We're looking pretty good. The winds are calm. It's just amazing. Well, it's hazy. It is hazy today. Mostly all day it's hazy. You got that storm. It's usually no wind anyway. It's usually nice and calm. No gusting or anything like that. We already switched tanks. Thank you, Avenine, for reminding me. That's our half an hour, half an hour reminder. So, yeah, so we can come on the 45. We'll go out, okay, towards the ridge. Uh, we'll do a 225 heading, which we're kind of on already. And then we'll go a left turn to the midfield uh, 45. And that'll be the easiest way to get in. Um, we'll listen to traffic and see what's going on. Celsius, altimeter 3015. Okay, we got all that. Traffic, 9 we LPR turning left base, runway 4 in County. Orange County traffic, good morning, Mooney 688, 7 November, 10 miles out to the northeast. Uh, we're going to make a right turn, go out towards the ridge, and then get on the 45 for the midfield. Left downwind 4, Orange County traffic. Orange County traffic, 908 LPR, turning left final, runway 4, traffic today. It's just the best way to do it. Keep everybody sequenced. So, uh, we got 1,400 feet of traffic pattern. We'll put that in as a reminder. And we're all looking good. Lane Lake can come on now. Let's look for traffic. Got nothing in front of me quite yet. I got a lot of a lot of practice planes out there by the ridge. And we keep heading downhill here. Very nice. 300, 300, 350 uh, feet per minute on our descent. So it looks good. Got our winds, 
107. Seven knot crosswind component. But very nice and calm wind. I'm very surprised I didn't hit any bumps coming over to, but close to the ridge over there. So nothing's really blowing over and coming around to cause turbulence out from the east. Uh, out from the west, I'm sorry. Typically the, the winds come out from the west. Which hits the ridges and causes a vortex and causes some gusts of wind or uh, some bumps. And when it's really gusty out, uh, you get by the ridge and your plane is all over the place. <laughs> Those are all normal, and I, I tell a lot of the students and, and people I talk to, I, the bumps and, excuse me, the, the bumps and stuff, that, that's our normal. You just stay in the green arc. You don't want to fly through thunderstorms, obviously, and all that stuff. You know, you have all the technology, and like I said, with four flight. You know, as long as you're in the green, you hit some bumps here and there, your plane's not going to fall apart. So just, uh, you know, the biggest thing is thunderstorms and, and heavy buildups. You don't want to go through that. The buildups... Is, is you know you have you know the winds pushing straight up, so you get caught up in that, your plane might fall apart. So you don't want to avoid all those at all costs. The normal bumps, turbulent air, and stay in the green. You're not going to fall apart. It's normal. Just put your seatbelt on tighter. Okay, so we're going to put in some mixture. Got two planes, one plane on the go, one plane make, looks like making a left base, or I'm sorry, a left crosswind. We're looking for them. I have my landing light on. Uh, we're going to be ready for landing. That was basically it. Maybe I'll do a touch and go. What the heck? Let's join the fun. Let's do a touch and go. We're going to use zero 04, so let's go down to 4, four zero. Be one way. All right. Well, there's our way. Turn into 45. Orange County traffic. Mooney, 87 members, about 5 mile 45. For the midfield left downwind for 4. We're looking for the traffic. And slow her down more. Way too fast for gear speed. Way too fast. 133 Delta Alpha, short approach on wave 4, Orange County. Orange County traffic, Piper's turning crosswind for 04, Orange County. There's that crosswind traffic. I got a downwind traffic, looks like, on the screen here. And landing light is on. Everything is. I got to slow down because I'm going to catch up these guys very quickly. It's very hard to fly moving the pattern. Um, with slower planes, it doesn't like to go slow. It just doesn't. It just run, doesn't run right. Orange County traffic. Piper's turning down wind to zero four. And Piper, I'm going to be looking for you, sir. We are about a two mile now, 45 for the midfield. Left down wind four. We're looking for you, sir. Right, we're looking for you as well. I have you in sight, sir. Looks like you're just over the mountain, uh, approaching the pond there. Uh, we'll maintain visual separation. Okay, I'm at 1,500. I'm still we're climbing, and we're looking for you. Fox Whiskey entering left downwind, uh, one zero. Or is it one zero today, or what? Yeah, oh, we have you in sight. Three 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 short front runway four, touch of Orange County. Orange County traffic, Navajo is on a RNAV runway two six, approximately four miles out, full stop, Orange County traffic. We are midfield. And Orange County traffic, Mooney is midfield. Left downwind uh, four, we have the departing traffic in sight. We'll maintain visual separation, Orange County traffic. Uh, we have your inside as well. All right, looking good. We are in gear speed. All right, let's put the gear down. Don't forget the gear, folks. Don't forget the gear. And it's expensive, and the insurance loves to jack our rates up because everybody does gear ups. Orange County Trafka, Navajo short final, runway 26, Orange County. Okay, so let's do, uh, I'll do two flaps here. Looking good, runway's over there. The gas, undercarriage, mixture, props full four, mixture's full rich. Orange County Traffic, Mooney, 87 member, is turning base now for four, Orange County. I 
I'd typically like to be at 1,200, making the left base. Nice, nice turn, was squared off. All right, so let's put in more flaps. We'll, we'll put full flaps in now. The landing traffic in sight on 26. He's gonna do a full stop. Undercarriage, mixture, props, speed, flaps are full, mixtures full, rich, props full, forward. And Orange County traffic, Mooney, 8 set number, base to final, 4. Touch and go, Orange County. We'll do touch and go, why not? Okay, nice turn in. Orange County traffic, Diamond, 133 Delta Alpha is departing the pattern to the northwest. 500. 500 feet over the ground. They're high. Gas undercarriage is locked. Mixture prop flaps. All right, we're getting down to three degrees. Here, flaps are full, we're good, gear is down. Gear down indicated on the panel and the dyne on screen. We'll continue, trim up a little bit more. Booty short final for Orange County traffic, touch and go. Looking good, they can pull the power. The way is made, power to idle. Hold off to air. Perfect. All right. Nice and easy. Full oh, power is in. Looking for 60. We're going to rotate. The birds get out of the way. Please, please, please. Okay. Here is coming up. Here is up and locked. The manual flaps. You don't want to put flaps full up, obviously. You go sink. It's real quick. Boom. Boom. Gears up. That nice speed, and the flaps can come up full, trim down. There's a mountain. Traffic, Moody, left crosswind, four, Orange County. Temperatures are perfect, right where I want them. Fuel flow is perfect. Now, close crosswind, only two six, hot Bravo. Orange Looking perfect. Over the pond we go, around the mountain we go. Let's square it off, pull the power way back, way back. How nice and square that is. A little bit to the left. Orange County traffic, Moody downwind, four. We're at 1400 where we need to be. Well, that's it. That's a, that's a touch and go there. We don't have to worry about the mixture. We're nice and calm. It's awesome with calm days. It's like awesome. Back. It's square. Okay, not in gear speed yet. 
our gear speed. So gas under carriage is down. Sure has been rich. Prop coming full forward. And we'll do two. And trim up a hair. The reciprocal of four is two two. So we're just on two two heading, which is a perfect square. All right, Orange County traffic. Moody turning left base now for four Orange County traffic. Good. Get a little bit lower here. Nice and slow. Leaving altitude. All right. Flaps are full. Orange County traffic. Mooney turning final four. Orange County traffic. County traffic, 8 Lima Alpha, 8 Mile Final for runway 4, Orange County traffic. There's 84, there's 211, in front of us, that's a big warehouse straight ahead. Just got done building that. Popping up everywhere. Just can't find people to, to fill them. 500. Like 18 bucks an hour even. Orange County traffic, we short final for full stop this time around. Orange County. All right. Laps are full gas. Undercarriage is down a walk. Mitchell Rich, Rich pops full forward. I'm going to watch our speed. Let's go. miles an hour too fast. Looking for 70 knots here. 70 knots. Over the fence here. Too white, too red. Perfect light. All right, gear check over time. Good. Power is all the way up for idle. Orange County traffic, 8 Lima Alpha, 6 Perfect. Mile Final, Runway 4, Orange County traffic. That is it, folks. Touch and go. All the fun stuff we can do. And Alpha 2, I'll get off here. Orange County traffic, when you clear for Alpha 2, taxiing to T4, Orange County traffic. Okay, mixture can come out, fuel pump can come off. Open the door. No air. Orange County, automated advisory, wind, calm, altimeter. So, folks, there you have some flight following, you have some ATC, you have some uh, touch and go. So pattern work, pretty pretty easy. And the more you fly, the more you practice, the more you practice in wind in wind gusts, depending on what your max what your, uh, uh, your max is uh, yourself, what you can can't can handle, what your plane can can and can't handle. Uh, but Orange County has nice practice runways. They're, both of them are wide. One's five thousand, I think one is uh, thirty five or eight hundred. Uh, so crosswind landings practice here is pretty cool because you have the um, fun ways to do that and are wide. Um, so you can correct yourself if you're off. Uh, but I always practice that um, 
because like when you go to if you go to Block Island, you go somewhere else. You could be in a crosswind situation. What are you gonna do? Not land? You know, go back home because it's a, a crosswind. Maybe it's a, an eight knot crosswind. Uh, uh, crosswind. So that's why you practice and they do all this fun stuff. When you get your license, I remember my instructor, not my instructor, uh, my DEP, and it was like you go to my check ride, and they told me. You passed. You're going to pass. Prove to me I'm going to fail you. And that is what they, they don't want to fail people. They, they want people to fly because the, the, the instructors and the trek ride people, they all know that your license is a license to learn a lot more because you can experience everything in your 40 hours. I mean, you know, you're not going places in your, as a student pilot where you can go and experience the islands where there's always crosswinds or there's this or there's gusts or this and that so they know that you know the basics and they know that you're going to venture off into different things and you're going to practice more and get better as time goes on um, and that's what you need to do and you need to stay proficient um, and stay current and just make sure everything is great and it's an awesome experience that's why I really enjoy flying in a boonie uh, they only would bias to have a booty, but it's a nice, fast little airplane. You're not, you know, burning up your wallet with fuel, and you can have fun and go places and not burn your wallet up uh, for fuel costs and maintenance is low on this plane. Um, so yeah, so Orange practice County makes dead. perfect. Alpha, one mile final runway four. Hey guys, we're obviously here at Orange County Airport. Take flight is over here to our left. You see all the planes they have. All the cars are already packed here. Um, you need a flight school in the area, take flight aviation, folks. It's the best in the country. Check them out online, Facebook, Instagram, all over the place. And if you like what I'm doing, please subscribe to the channel. Gotcha. I would appreciate that. Yeah, but when I'm back notifications, you can hit the bell, and you get all back notifications every time I upload a video. And I'm on Facebook, TikTok, and Instagram. Again, thank you guys for the support on uh, Facebook. 36,000 almost. Coaching. Until next time, guys, fly safe, be safe. And I'll see you in the cockpit soon. See ya.